uh, viongozi wawili tuseme wewe una ngombe 18 upate ngombe zote 16 ziko pamoja vile tumekaa hapa na ni ngombe mbili zimejificha kwa kichaka pale sugoe sasa ni hizi zimepotea ama ni zile mbili ni sisi tumepotea ama wale wawili si ni wale wawili wako kwa kichaka kule sugoe ninyi mtaenda nao ama waende peke yao waende peke yao sio sasa hiyo ndio resolution yetu siku ya leo sisi tumesema tutatembea pamoja na tunarudi mashinani tunarudi kwa kila county kwa kila sub county in this region tutaenda kwa kila ward kila sub location in this region kwa kuhakikisha ya kwamba kura zote in our region zinaenda kikapu kimoja mko tayari tufanye hivyo mko tayari hebu nione mikono mna wasema mko tayari basi nafikiri hilo ndio jambo kubwa limetuleta hapa kuna wale wametuuliza mmekuwa kakamega december mbona umerudi kakamega sisi tunasema wakati wa masai wana jambo mbiru ya mgambo ikilia kule umasaini wamasai wanakutana suswa mbiru ya mgambo ikilia hapa western tunakutana wapi kakamega so tuko hapa to tell the nation all and sundry ya kwamba western is unshaken western is united behind Raila Amolo Odinga na leo tunaanza safari yetu mwisho nataka niseme tuko na sababu imefanya tuunge azimio na sio ule mrengo mwingine because to me the choice is as clear as night and day Kenyans have two clear choices kuna wale wametudanganya hapa ati wako oka ati wataenda watuletee serikali kwa oka si msali walikuwa ndotudanganya hapo nikawauliza hii oka inamaanisha nini hawakuniambia kumbe kwa kikikuyu mtu akikwambia oka oka haha anamaanisha nini oka haha anamaanisha nini kumbe hawa jamaa mi nao para yatuliwaambia farasi ni wawili ni Raila na Ruto hawa wakakaa katikati kumbe wamengoja Ruto awaambie oka haha oka haha oka haha si Ruto amepita hapa juzi akawaambia oka haha si walienda na ujue mtu akikwambia oka haha ukienda si unajua anaenda kukufinya kitu si ayub sabula ametuambia walifinywa pesa ngapi hizo pesa wamegawana na ninyi watu wa Western si wamekula peke yao so sisi tutaenda mbele and we want to take the route that will unite this country and for me it is very clear that in this election in this year Kenyans are going to choose unity over division because we have one team that is talking about a united indivisible nation called Kenya under the Azimio ban lakini tuko na ile timu nyingine ya UDA wamekuwa Eldred Juzi wakisema kuna madoa doa na kuna wale sio madoa doa hiyo ni kugawanya wa Kenya ama kuunganisha wa Kenya si nagawanya wa Kenya kwa misingi ya kikabila kusema hawa ni madoa doa wale ndio sio madoa doa sisi tumesema hatutakubali siasa ya kutugawanya kwa misingi ya kikabila misingi ya kidini ama kiuchumi kusema sisi ni hasla nation wale wengine ni dynasties hatuwataki we want ile barabara ya unity ya azimio ambayo itatuunganisha sisi sote that will not just speak for the Hasland nation but the entire Kenyan nation 47 million of us in all our 47 counties munaunga hiyo mkono mwisho tuko na mambo ya ufisadi mimi nikianza safari na uhuru kenyata na leo lazima nikubali haya before the luya nation Sijawahi support Raila Odinga mimi. Mimi nimekuwa na Uhuru Kenyatta. Na Uhuru Kenyatta amekuwa anapigania vitu viwili, to unite this country and to rid it of corruption. Lakini juzi nimeangalia pale bombers. Wale nimeona pale bombers ilikuwa kama the legion of the extraordinary saboteurs of the Kenyan economy. Wale walioharibu uchumi wetu from the 90s wale walio the owners wa cash wa zote Kenya wamehesabiwa hapa hebu niwaulize nione kama mlikuwa makini mwenye cash ya golden bag na anglo leasing ni nani ni nani si mlimuona bomas 
mwenye kashfa ile ya Tokyo na dhahabu ya DRC na ile ingine ya Huyo ni nani? Ni nani? Simuli muona bomas? Mwenye kashfa ile ya NYS waliokula mabilioni ya pesa ni nani? Ni nani? Muli muona bomas? Mwenye aror na kimwarer na maindi na skando zote ni nani? Muli muona bomas? Sasa jamani tukisema tuachie taifa hili wenye kashfa zote umehesabu hapa sio mimi nimetaja majina yao si ni ninyi jamani tunasema this Kenya na uchumi wa Kenya uko safe in whose hands is our economy safe in whose hands is Kenya safe mwisho mambo ya devolution mimi nimekuwa waziri wa ugatuzi hawa magavana tumefanya kazi nao and na watu wa Kakamega we must thank you mulitupa gavana wa nguvu sana huyo paranya has made a mark kwa historia ya devolution ya taifa letu nilikuwa naye nikiwa waziri wake yeye akiwa chairman wa council of governors kama kuna county imeperform Kenya hii ni hii county ya Kakamega lakini pia tunajua the future of devolution in whose hands is devolution said kuna yule alipinga devolution 10 years ago 2010 akasema had, had no to this constitution that brought us devolution anaitwa nani lakini there is the one who championed devolution and akahakikisha 7 million of us said yes ndio tukapata ugatuzi tukawa na serikali zetu hizi tano na zile zingine 42 ni nani ali champion devolution tukawa nayo Kenya ni nani alipinga devolution nani alipinga devolution nani aliunga devolution kwa BBI ni nani ametaka kuimarisha devolution sasa the choice to me is as clear as night and day If we want devolution to be protected the champion of devolution is none other than Raila Odinga. If we want our economy to be safe and Kenya to be protected from economic saboteurs that job can be done by none other than Raila Odinga. If we want a united nation that will bring us all together under one roof as one family bila wengine kuitwa madoa doa ama kuchomewa nyumba ama kuwawa sababu wao ni jamii tofauti There's only one man who can ensure that united country called Kenya and it's called Raila Molo Odinga. Asante ni Mungu abariki. Oh yeah. Twendele. Nataka niongee machache kabisa kwa sababu naona saa inaenda. Alafu nikaribishe Mzee Francis Atoni na karibisha wale wazee ambao wako hapa tunataka wazee wetu wamalize Wesa nuoye Wesa nuoye Kwanza naleta salamu kutoka kwa baba Raila Odinga Nione wale wamepokea salamu za Raila Odinga Na leo Wezan wamesema hawajasema. Wamekohoa hawajakohoa. Wajaamua wameamua. Leo tumeandika historia. Tangu mimi niwe mwanasiasa sijaona watu wa Wezan wakija pamoja vile wamekuja siku ya leo. Nataka mchipikie makofi wale ambao wamekuja hapa wote na sasa western kwa sababu wale wameenda ndio walikuwa shida kwetu sasa sisi njia iko wazi tuendelee mbele ndio mimi nilikuwa kwa ile serikali ya Mwai Kibaki ni wakati Mwai Kibaki alikuwa anatoka kwa kiti 
uchumi wa nchi hii ulikuwa unakaribia 10% ulikuwa unaendelea kabisa kulingana na ile vision 2030 lakini wakati serikali ya jubilee iliingia na wengine hapo ndani wakaanza ufisadi ndio kwa sababu inji hii imerudi nyuma na mheshimiwa huru kinyata aliona mapema na akaamua ile ata aliamua kwa sababu aliona ufusadi mwingi katika serikali yake na hii miaka tano ambaye yeye peke yake amekuwa pale juu hii hiji sasa imeendelea kidogo kwa sababu ufisadi ndio umerudisha inji hii chini na mimi najua Raila akiwa rais wa tano wa inji hii hiyo mambo ya ufisadi atamaliza katika inji hii mimi najua inji yetu ya Kenya tuna pesa ya kutosha ambayo inaweza kusaidia watu wetu waendelee mbele kibiashara na mambo mengine yote ndio kwa sababu mnaona sisi tunamuunga Raila Molo mkono wananchi wale wako hapa na viongozi wote mmeona wa viongozi wa western wale wako hapa nataka tushikane tushikane tukiwa na shida ya kinyumbani sisi wenyewe tukae chini na tutatue na tuendelee mbele ndio kwa sababu tukitoka hapa kwa sababu hii ni tsunami kama wewe hayuko hapa ujue njia yako iko wazi ya kwenda nyumbani kwa sababu tumesema viongozi wetu wote hii ni njia ambayo itasaidia watu wetu wa western wale watu wote ambao wanaishi hapa na tukitoka hapa vile mumesikia Ijumaa tuko kule Busia. Ningetaka nyinyi wote na hao viongozi tuwe kule Busia. Tuanzie kule Alamisi. Alamisi. On Thursday twende Busia tutokee kule Teso alafu twende kule Busia Stadium. Ijumaa on Friday Tuondoke hapo twende Bungoma Bosa Glam vile tuko hapo Ndio wakenya wajue Western tuko pamoja Na Jumatatu ile ijayo itakuwa tarehe gapi Jumatatu all aspirants all aspirants wa azimio ukiwa okay, unataka MCA unataka kuwa MP Nataka kuwa gavana, nataka kuwa senator, nataka kuwa woman rep chini ya simio. Tutakutana hapa Kakamega. Tujue nani anataka nini. Kwa sababu tumeamua tuwe na kamati ndogo ambayo itaongea na hawa watu. Tuwe na masikizano. Hatutaki tunyumbane. Kila kila position tuwe na mtu mmoja wa azimi hatukojei watu wengine wakupange sisi wenyewe tunataka tufanye nini si ndio ndio tumeanza kujipanga na tutatoa chama na hiyo kamati tutatoa kule nje mtu ambaye yeye iko neutral ambaye anaweza kuzungumza na hawa na waone haki waone haki imefanyika si ndio na nimesikia nikimalizia nimesikia wale watu wa Tangatanga wakisema Raila Amolo Odinga ni project ya uhuru kinyata ya serikali hii miaka yote mmeona Raila Amolo Odinga jamii yeye yeah, anaweza kuwa project ya mtu na baba ndiye alikuwa na natija wa kina uhuru kinyata na Ruto pamoja Muda baadhi yeta uhuru park kwa pishwa na uhuru park
Raila Amolo Odinga ni project ya zimkani. Sawa Francis naona watu wanapambaika wengine wanaenda mbali wengine wanajua wanaenda tuanzoia kule kijana ni mbali masaa mawili kutoka hapa kwa hivyo nitakupa hii nafasi ni utumie hii nafasi nzuri najua wewe unapenda mambo ya kuongea na wanaiji kama hawa kama mnakutana so ningetaka mwenyewe utaamua mzee gani atakuja hapa aongee kidogo na wewe uongee alafu tupate maombi alafu tuende nyumbani Mungu awabariki Thank you very much. Asante. Asante ni sana. Mimi nitaongea kwa ufupi sana. Kwa ajili kwa ajili saa imeenda. Kuna watu wametoka Busia. Kuna watu wametoka Tanzania wakiongozwa na gavana wa huko bwana Natembea. Mimi nataka kuwajulisha kitu cha kwanza ni mimi kuwapigia Santa kabla sijaita mnenaji kutoka kwa elders nataka kuwapigia asanti tarehe moja disemba mlifunja record ya dunia kwa kujaa katika Buhungu stadium na watu elfu kumi wakabaki nje hii imeonyesha njia na imeonyesha ya kwamba tuna nia tuna sababu na tuna uwezo kama jamii ya mkoa wa Magharibi Mimi niliambia William Samoei Ruto Na sijui ni kwa nini hamuniamini Sijui ni kwa nini msali ya Mudavadi na Moses Weta hawawezi kuamini mimi Mimi ndio peke yangu mwaka wa 2016 Nilitumia zaidi ya shilingi elfu mbili milioni mbili kumfanya msalia kuwa mlelaji wenu. Na hakuita hata mkutano mmoja isipokuwa utamsikia katika matanga ama katika church ya friends kule Maringo. Mimi nataka kuambia nyinyi sasa hivi. Mimi nataka kuambia nyinyi sasa hivi huwezi kuwa ulikuwa unatafuta mnafuata kuku ili mshike mkiko ujombani mchinjiwe na imushinde na kesho yake mmoja wenu ashike na mmoja aende achinje hiyo kuku na watu wengine mtakuwa washenzi sana kwa hivyo mimi nataka kuambia hivi wale vijana wetu chukueni kura kwa wingi mlisikia shinari akisema ya kwamba wataangalia wadui wamekuja na kura ngapi mjaribu sana mtembee kwa hizi siku tumebaki muhakikishe ya kwamba tumechukua kura kwa wingi na mimi nataka kuambia hivi hakuna rerun Nasikia wale wanajidai wanasema oh sisi tutashinda watashinda wana nani Saa hii Mudhama iko kwa forward one Mudhama ashasema kwa ajili jana msali alisema ya kwamba hawachachaguana katika hicho kikundi chao Mudhama amesema hawa walikuja kwao kwa UDA kama marafiki Hakuna agreement. Chairman wa UDA kushatema hawa tiari. Etabu hiyo msavi. Ukiwa muombaji ndio mambo inafanyika kwako hivi. Wataenda wapi? Kwa hivyo mimi nataka kuwajulisha tu nyinyi mfanye hivi. Tubaki kitu kimoja na mimi nataka hawa watu wa magazeti na watu wa television. Nimesema Western Kenya yote iko kwa azimio. Na watu hawaamini. Nataka hizi kamera ziangalie kwa watu mubebe mkono. 
wale wako kwa azimio please Turn your cameras. Turn your cameras. He, he, ule ruta alikuwa nao jana kiambu. Unashinda ule umati ruta alikuwa nao katika kirinyaga siku ya jimamosu. Na wengi wenu mnatengeneza kamera kuonyesha ruta alikuwa na watu wengi. Mungoje Mungoje tarehe tisa Na nimesema muamuke mapema. Sane tuwe tumemaliza kura. Mimi nilisema mwaka wa elfu mbili na kumu, mwaka elfu mbili na kumi na ine, 2014. Ya kwamba William Samoei Ruto hata kuwa president. Na I have no apologies. Na it is not if or in the event. There is nothing that in the event he becomes. There is nothing like in the event when he will not. Nasikia. Kwa hivyo mimi nilikuwa nataka kuhakikishia hiyo mimi ndio natembea na hawa. Mimi ndio najaribu kuweka watu wetu pamoja. Mimi ndio kinara yao. Na mimi ndio naangalia. Na nataka kuambia Eugene yuko hapa. Eseri yuko hapa. Wa mnyinyi ndio hayuko hapa. Kaka mega 100% Nazimio. Busia 100% Nazimio. Vihiga. Vihiga. Na mtuma. Kijana yamu kijana shupafu kwa mweshimiwa omulele. Amuambio mboko miremba. Atapotea. Mimi ni onilipereka hee huku. Atoke huku. Bungoma. Bungoma. Na mwasame hiku hapi hapa. Mwasame hiku hapa. Kuna reporter hapa. Yule reporter anaitwa Mwasame ni anajua kazi tulifanya Bungoma na Weta ataenda nyumbani Na muambia rafiki yangu Sipika Lusaka Ageuke mapema Atafuta wa maliwa Atafuta wa mnyinyi Kwa jili there will be nothing like Ford King I swear Sika kwa msema mambo mingi Nataka kwa chiapo kama mze wenu Na kwa kikishia kwamba Sisi zote katika Western Kenya tuko katika azimio na sanne mtu ukiwa na kalamu yako uandike mbunge ama MCA atakayekuwa na tikiti ya azimio sanne atakuwa ashachaguliwa hatuwezi kukubali hatuwezi kukubali tena muambie William Samoei Ruto awache kutukana viongozi Anadarau hata mimi ambaye ni kiongozi wenu mzee wenu. Kwa hivyo mkutano wote atakaoita kama ni kakamega musiane. Nataka kumuita mzee wa ngamata ameuliza ya kwamba nimuulize mwana Ludava ambaye ndio secretary wa elders wetu wa Western Kenya aja ongee kwa huu muda umetoka umebaki mambo machache na nataka kusifu sana hao wazee ndio walifanya mkutano wetu wa tarehe 31 usaksid msiende muasikize kidogo bwana dudava alo alo jameni tunataka mambo 
projet de la résolution en bas de la zone de Bishop Samala, Mbunge Wahab. Azimio, Waze, Hawata Enda Komaneno Mengi Manake Walimaliza Maneno Tare Talatina Moja. Tulipeana Mwelekeo, Kwamba Kila Mtu, Akisimama Nataka Kura, Asimame Kwa Azimio. Na Kila Mtu Ataka Echaguliwa, Atako Azimio Pekea. Sasa Tufate Iyo. Na mkienda nyumbani, mweneze hiyo maneno kila pahali. Tuko hapa na wazee, kama wangesimama tu, waonekane. Mzee wetu chama nyuko hapo nyuma, alikuwa mechoka yendi, alitakana apeane ujumu. Asante. Aya, sasa na mkaribisha mwishimiwa... Bishop Ramada kuja kusoma resolution ya siku ya leo. Okay, resolutions by the Western leaders on the 31st January 2022. 31st at Golf Hotel Kakamega. We, the leaders of Western Region, led by CS Eugene Wamalua, Excellency Governors Weekly Poparanya, Sos Peter Ojamong, Will Bautichlo, Weekly Wangamati, Patron of Nuya Council of Elders, Secretary General of Kotu, Dr. Franz Atwoli, Members of Parliament, MCS, hundreds of aspirants and grassroots leaders focusing as a community and having been directed by elders on the 31st December 2021, appreciating our diversity, acknowledging our love for peace and unity of purpose, noting that the country is geared towards political transition and our community having decided that they will be part and parcel of the new Kenya and therefore resolve as follows. Number one, that we condemn the actions of Honorable Wycliffe Musaliam Dabadi and uh, Honorable Moses Wetangula for attempting to auction the Luya community to a presidential candidate without consultation and approval of the citizens of the region. We thank our community for rejecting in total to be sold cheaply, that we remain solidly behind the candidature of His Excellency Raila Amolo Dinga as our preferred candidate and we will continue to mobilize our community to support and vote for him as the fifth president of the Republic of Kenya. Resolution number three, that we shall form the next government with His Excellency Raila Molodinga. Number four, that the community shall only vote for candidates in all other positions who are allied to and or members of Azmio Laumoja. Resolution number five, and the last one, that with effect from today, the 31st day of January 2022, we are moving to the grassroots to mobilize our community, to utilize the remaining days of voter registration, to register as voters and ensure they are ready to cast their votes into one basket of Azmio Laumoja. All this signed on behalf of all Western Region leaders by number one, Honorable Emmanuel Wangwe, Chief Whip, National Assembly, His Excellency Dr. Wycliffe Ambezo Paranya, Governor Kakamega County, His Excellency Dr. Will Bautichilo, Governor Vihiga, His Excellency Wycliffe Wangamati, Governor Bungoma, His Excellency Honorable Sospita Ajamong, Governor Busia, and Dr. Francis Atuoli. Patron Luya Elders Forum. Thank you. God bless you all.